Dio's Lament, an Anglo-Saxon lyric poem of personal sorrow and resilience. Within the realm of Anglo-Saxon literature, Dio's Lament stands as a poignant and introspective lyric poem. Composed in Old English, this remarkable work explores themes of personal sorrow, loss, and resilience. Through its introspective verses and emotional depth, Dio's Lament offers a glimpse into the human experience, demonstrating the enduring power of poetry as a means of processing and expressing complex emotions. Let us delve into the significance and lasting impact of this extraordinary Anglo-Saxon lyric poem. Dio's Lament presents an unnamed narrator reflecting on their personal struggles and hardships. The poem takes the form of a lamentation, where the speaker acknowledges their own misfortune while drawing upon the tales of legendary figures who endured similar challenges. Through its structure and content, the poem becomes a cathartic exploration of sorrow and a testament to the resilience of the human spirit. The poem's introspective nature allows readers to empathize with the narrator's experiences of loss, rejection, and disappointment. It serves as a reminder of the universal nature of human suffering, highlighting the power of poetry to provide solace and healing in times of distress. Dio's Lament draws upon the stories of legendary figures from Germanic and Anglo-Saxon mythology and history. The poem references individuals who faced adversity but ultimately overcame their challenges, serving as symbols of hope and inspiration. By invoking these figures, the narrator finds solace in the notion that even great heroes and rulers have faced tribulations, and they IR stories offer lessons in perseverance. The poem's inclusion of these mythological and historical references showcases the cultural and literary knowledge of the Anglo-Saxon society. It reflects the importance of storytelling and the transmission of cultural heritage through oral tradition, as well as the belief in the power of narrative to provide guidance and strength during difficult times. Dio's Lament exhibits intertextuality by referencing and alluding to other poems and legends. The narrator quotes lines from other works, such as the epic poem, Beowulf, and the heroic tale of, the Finnisberg Fragment, connecting their personal anguish to the broader literary tradition. This intertextual technique adds depth and complexity to the poem, reinforcing its connection to the wider body of Anglo-Saxon literature. Furthermore, the poem's intertextual references highlight the interconnectedness of literary works and the enduring themes of human experience that transcend time and place. Dio's Lament serves as a testament to the ongoing dialogue between poets and their predecessors, illustrating the ways in which literature builds upon and enriches itself through allusion and intertextual engagement. Dio's Lament continues to resonate with readers across time and cultures due to its exploration of universal emotions and the human capacity for resilience. The poem's themes of personal struggle, loss, and the search for meaning remain relevant in our contemporary world, where individuals face their own trials and seek solace and strength in the face of adversity. Moreover, Dio's Lament serves as a testament to the enduring power of poetry as a means of M. Emotional expression and introspection. It reminds us of the transformative potential of literature to provide solace, provoke reflection, and foster a sense of shared humanity. Dio's Lament stands as a profound Anglo-Saxon lyric poem that delves into themes of personal sorrow, resilience, and the enduring power of poetry. It has introspective verses and elusive references.